Hello viewers, welcome to Ultimate Gaming Guide. I'm Tanver, how are you all doing today? I'm doing awesome because I got myself a new SSD. So I thought I would do a video on it. So if you have gotten yourself a new SSD and you plug that into your computer and for some reason that SSD is not showing up, then this video is for you. In case you don't know how to install an NVMe SSD, uh, the NVMe slot looks like this. There's a, like a little notch right here. So what are you going to do? You're going to line up your NVMe drive with that notch right here and it goes in like this. So I mean you can make a mistake here. So once you plug in the NVMe SSD, you're going to press your Windows button and type in device manager. Click that device manager and okay so once you are in device manager, uh, you're going to go to disk drive and check if the NVMe is showing up. So for me, this is ADATA Legend 740. So I verified that it's working. So afterwards, you're going to press your uh, Windows button again and type in partition. And select create and format disk partitions. And now you must initialize the disk you just inserted. So just go with the GPT. Uh, and select OK. Uh, so once you initialize your SSD, scroll down to find your uh, NVMe drive. For me, this is the one, disk 5. So I'm just going to right click here, click simple volume, click next, click next, and assign a drive letter. I'll just go with the default, click next, and just in here you can change the name. I'll change the name to NVMe SSD and click next click finish and now your ssd will show up the windows autoplay already notified me that a new nvme ssd has been plugged in so i can go to file explorer to verify that and there it is and that's how you can configure a new nvme ssd in your computer in case it's not showing up I hope this little tutorial was helpful to you. Be sure to like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. You have a good one.